The flawlessly gated Be a Magician was a powerhouse in 2012 and carries the distinction of being the only trotter to knock off fellow finalist to dream on. The daughter of Cadabra was a standout in the Ontario Sire Stakes, winning seven of nine starts, including the $300,000 OSS Super Final at Woodbine, where she dominated the field while equaling her career best clocking of 153 and 4. Be a magician showing her class here tonight as she brings this field into the final eighth of the mile, and it's all Be a Magician. Be a Magician also notched a victory in the Champlain Stakes and followed that up with wins in both her elimination and final of the Peaceful Way Stakes. The latter being a hard fought neck decision in 153 and 4. And Be a Magician is collared to Dream On. Be a Magician on the outside. Two Dream On fights back. Two great fillies, just one winner, and it's Be a Magician to win it by a neck. To Dream On was just a neck away from a perfect season in 2012, winning eight of nine races. The regally bred daughter of credit winner was a $200,000 yearling buy and more than tripled that purchase price with her earnings during a brilliant rookie campaign for owners Marvin Katz and Al Libfeld. One of her most impressive races of the season was the Marietta Bell Final at the Meadowlands, where she rallied from a very tough spot to gun down the field in 154. Big, long, powerful strides from two, Dream On, and Dave Miller in the Marietta Bell. To Dream On also scored victories in a division of the Reynolds Stakes, Bluegrass Stakes, and International Stallion Stakes. Her richest payday came in the Breeders' Crown at Woodbine, where she dominated her foes by more than three lengths in 154 and 4. It is Jingra and Tactor and the talented trotting daughter of credit winner who wins the Breeders' Crown final for two-year-old trotting fillies.